Hello there, this is a star. It's a big orange star. And I'm using orange chalk on yellow paper to make the star look even more starry. A lot of this picture is just basically me colouring boiling pools of superheated gas. Anyway, uh, yes, this is a star. And in front of it, there is going to be a little silhouette. It's a silhouette of a DBX, I think. And that's the sort of place you might imagine a DBX being, because uh, they, they've got quite small fuel tanks but they do an awful lot of travelling because they're a good travelling ship. You can get a good 40-odd light year jump range on them. And I mean, if you're willing to go around all the engineers, you get high 60s. So it is just, yeah, it really pulls its weight. And they're really cheap, really small, nippy. And also conveniently for fuel scooping, which you're going to need to do a lot of, they're quite heat efficient. They don't overheat particularly, so uh, so that's quite good. Oh yeah, uh, there's another kind of funky thing you can do with a DBX is... Uh, you can do stealth combat or stealth runs, which is quite easy to manage in a DVX because they are so cold. They run so cold, so you, you can keep your emanating heat down and be a little bit less obvious on people's radars, especially if you throw a few heat sinks out here and then or use silent running. You can pretty much go invisible and, uh, and you can get into stations with your smuggled spice or you, you can nip round to the back of someone and then shoot them the dbx has got a class 3 hard point so it, it actually can shoot things even though it's only a little dunnox dk of a ship with a very fragile exterior that you could easily squish but um but no it's not uh, it's actually quite it's, it's actually quite sturdy amazingly uh, as i have found many many times slamming it down onto the surface of planets if you want to just do a little explore mind you your issue with that is going to be that you have to choose you can't you just you can't go and say well i'll, I'll use my dbx or i might do a bit of this and i might no you either outfit it for exploration and make it light and increase your reach or you toughen it up and use it for stealth combat missions so you've got to choose because you just you just can't do both it's not multi-role in any way but if you use it if you if you do actually upgrade your ship and engineer it you've got a smashing little ship really i think they're great i think they look good because i quite like the way the wings sit up like a moth and then they they angle back down again when you sit down like it's making itself comfortable I think they're smashing little things Anyway, uh, I, I've gone on about DBX for quite a long time there, haven't I? Uh, thanks for listening. <laughs> I'll stop now.